In this work, we revisit existing integrators adopted in the material point method and propose new integrators targeting easier particle separation and less dissipation. We start by demonstrating the effectiveness of our method with this fountain. Our new velocity and position updating schemes can reduce excessive dissipation in grid particle transfers. The fountains simulated with our schemes, A-flip and AS-flip, are more energetic than A-pick and flip. Particles advected with AS-flip are also easier to separate from each other, allowing them to be spouted faster from the nozzle. We begin from flip, where the particle velocities are transferred to the grid, and then the particles are advected by velocities interpolated from the grid. Our first attempt to diminish the dissipation and untrap the particles is to advect the particles with particle velocities. We name this scheme and flip. In this example, two particles are supposed to move away from each other. Particles advected by pick, a pick, or a damped flip stop moving after the simulation start. On the other hand, particles advected by the end flip or full flip can move further away. In sand collapse, some particles could stay in the same but curved line due to the spatial trap when simulated with pick, flip, or a pick. Advecting with end flip eliminates this artifact. However, end flip has its defects. It handles neither particle-particle collision nor particle-boundary collision, as shown here. We propose a positional correction to fix these problems. When boundary conditions control the particles, we use the nodal velocities to advect. Otherwise, as the particles tend to expand, we mix the advection with more particles' velocities. Back to this fiber piling example, fibers simulated with S-flip slide down much faster than flip and A-pick, while collisions are also correctly handled. In this hourglass, N-flip and S-flip produce more flying particles, while S-flip correctly handles the boundary condition. Our positional correction also makes the particle easier to separate on more complex brittle materials. Here we compare it with other schemes on a lump of wet clay using the non-associated cam clay model. In this fracture example, a rectangle correctly breaks into pieces with S-flip. On the other hand, simulations with flip and A-pick can only break after reducing the dissipation by raising their resolution. In this example, flip and A-pick fail to separate the squares. Simulation with N-flip explodes soon due to unconstrained penetration, while S-flip succeeds in having the two squares separate. We also extend the flip scheme by combining it with A-pick, naming it A-flip. In this example, A-flip reproduces the complex structure, which only exists when using flip or A-pick with much higher resolution. We also compare with polypick, which fails to produce the structure. A-flip also preserves more energy than flip and A-pick. Its energy Energy preservation capability is comparable with polypick. We further enhance A-flip with positional correction to encourage particle separation and name it AS-flip. Only with both the positional and the velocity adjustment, the squares can separate. We compare different schemes over more complex 3D examples. Here we compare different schemes in a scenario where a will rolls up grits. Simulations with APIC are significantly more viscous. N-flip drives particles to the left side instead of the upper side. A flip and AS flip manage to distribute particles without clumping artifacts, and AS flip sprays more particles into the air. Here clay particles fall onto a non-frictional pre-fractured plate. With flip and APIC, the particles stick to the plates. With S flip or AS flip, the particles quickly slide. Here two pieces of initially packed clothes are pulled apart. The feature of easier particle separation improves the simulation quality even for a simple scenario. Simulations with flip and APIC manifest delayed separation due to numerical viscosity and produce resolution-dependent wrinkles. 
with our correction, neither issues exist anymore. In this scenario, without our corrections, a pick, flip, and AS flip fail to recover the rest shape, and the strands keep being entangled. On the other hand, AS flip and S flip do not suffer from this visual artifact. We also compare N flip, S flip, and the integrators in which only the boundary or the volume ratio is considered. N flip cannot handle any collision. Instead, S flip correctly handles both strand strand and strand boundary collisions. Finally, we demonstrate our integrators in a more complex scenario used in production. With our S-flip and AS-flip, the hairs flow and spread out smoothly. Thank you.